iOS 26 versus Android 16 call screening. Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. If you're like me, your phone probably rings off the hook with spam calls, robocalls, and just plain annoying numbers. It's a never-ending battle, right? But what if your phone could fight back for you? Both Apple and Google are stepping up their game with advanced call screening features. We're talking about iOS 26's enhanced call screening, building on live voicemail, and Android 16's powerful call screen by Google Assistant. Today, we're putting them head to head to see which one keeps your peace of mind intact and protects you better. Let's kick things off with iOS 26. Apple's approach to call screening is all about uninterrupted peace. When an unknown number calls, your iPhone won't blare out a ringtone immediately. Instead, it quietly takes the call and Siri steps in, asking the caller to state their name and the reason for their call. The magic happens next. You'll see a real-time transcript of the caller's message appearing right on your screen, almost like a live chat. From there, you can decide, do you pick up, do you hang up, or do you send them straight to voicemail? It's incredibly intuitive and keeps your personal space sacred. And the best part? All this processing happens on device, ensuring your privacy. It's a seamless way to filter out the noise. Now, let's switch over to Android 16's call screen, powered by Google Assistant. While iOS focuses on quiet filtering, Android's approach feels more like having a personal bouncer for your phone. When a call comes in, you can choose to screen call. Google Assistant will answer, asking, who is this and why are you calling? Again, you get that real-time transcript of the conversation. But here's where Android 16 shines. It goes beyond just screening. This version brings some serious security enhancements. It can detect and warn you about suspicious activity during a call, like attempts to get you to sideload an app or grant accessibility permissions, common tricks used by scammers. It's not just about filtering, it's about actively protecting you from malicious intent. You're in control, deciding how to interact with the caller or even choosing from preset quick replies. So what are the key differences when we put them side by side? iOS 16 is largely automatic for unknown numbers. Android 13 gives you the option to screen, though you can set it to auto-screen for spam. Philosophy. Apple wants to minimize disruption and give you information before you engage. Google is more about proactive defense, especially against sophisticated scams trying to exploit your device. Anti-scam features. This is where Android 16 takes the lead with its deeper integration to block harmful actions like sideloading apps during a call. iOS keeps things simple for filtering. User control. Android offers more direct interaction options with the caller through the assistant. Both do an excellent job with real-time transcription and on-device processing for privacy, but it's clear their priorities are slightly different. So, which one is better for you? If you prioritize a seamless, quiet filtering experience that keeps interruptions to a minimum, iOS 26's call screening might be your winner. It's elegant and efficient. But if you're constantly worried about advanced scams, and you want your phone to act as a robust bodyguard against phishing attempts and malicious actions during a call, then Android 16's call screen with its enhanced security features truly stands out. Ultimately, both are fantastic tools that make our digital lives a little less stressful. It's great to see these tech giants making our phones smarter at protecting us. What do you think? Which call screening feature are you more excited about? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe for more tech comparisons, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss our next deep dive. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.